Hello, my wonderful YouTube friends. What you are seeing here is a bomb that exploded in my apartment. Just kidding, this is what my apartment looks like after letting life in quarantine get the best of me. So today I decided to turn things around and do a deep cleaning, get my life together and in order. And I'm going to do my best while also keeping an eye on this little one. Before I get started, I do like to prep myself and turn on some motivating music. I usually just go to YouTube on my TV. Today I felt like some vampire weekend. It was a beautiful day, so I wanted to get some of those sunny beach vibes. Comment below on what music or playlist is your go-to. Then I decided to pour myself a good cup of iced coffee just to give myself a boost of energy. I am using this unsweetened cold brew medium roast coffee made by Starbucks along with their toffee nut or hazelnut creamer, I think it is. You can find both these at any grocery store and I'm kind of a coffee snob and I found out that this is what tastes best for me. Starting out in the kitchen, I have lots of dishes to wash. Some people find it weird, but I always have to put on gloves. Not only do I hate touching slimy and old food, but the main reason I put on these gloves is because I have really sensitive skin. I wash my dishes with really hot water so these gloves keep my hands from burning and getting dried out. They also give me a good grip on the dishes so they won't slide and break. Now that I'm all done with the dishes, I gave some time to dry them off and it's time to put them away. Once I'm done doing the dishes, I always make it a point to clean the sink afterwards and get all of the leftover food. I don't have a garbage disposal, so I kind of just put it all together down the strainer and then I remove the strainer and throw away any of the food that was in there into the trash can. Now it's time to wipe down the countertops. I am just using this Everspring multi-purpose spray and a dish rag that I got from Home Goods. I make sure to get underneath everything that's on the counter and then I go back and I clean up the sink area. I do get a lot of water on there when I'm doing the dishes. And I'm wiping down the microwave. This little area right here is where my boyfriend likes to do his work, so sometimes this space gets a little cluttered. I feel bad he doesn't have his own workspace, so I'm just clearing this area up. 
The stove actually wasn't very dirty, but mostly because I did clean it up and wipe it down a few days ago, but I decided I might as well give it another wipe down as I am doing a deep cleaning for today. And anytime I'm done cleaning, I always like to light a candle. This one is the coconut sea salt from Target. And just so you guys remember exactly how dirty my kitchen was, this is it before. And here it is after. Meanwhile, I have these two things going on in the background. Up next, I'm taking care of my workspace, my work desk. It honestly isn't that bad, but I decided to clear that space up while I could. Next up, I am going to be doing my laundry. I have all my bed sheets in the washer and all my clothing in the dryer, so I won't be able to make my bed until all those are done. Next up is the living room. I'm just clearing away everything on the coffee table and then giving that a good wipe down. bed is made and now it's time to move on to the bathroom which I honestly was really debating if it was worth cleaning as well um, it wasn't that dirty but it did need a wipe down Thank you again so much for watching my video. If you could please give this a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Any support is appreciated. Thanks so much.